Oh, look who's lucky. I'm Tanner Monkey. Let's get funky with Sticks, Master of Shadows. We gotta go and head towards Sticks. But first. But first. No, no. Never mind. No upgrading skills. We're just gonna. We're just gonna go. Certainly not. Nothing wrong can go. What in the blue? Oh, oh, shit. Ah, yes, that's just perfectly fine. Doomed. Better avoid any contact with them. Okay. Sounds good, Stax. Sounds good. All right, all right. These things are becoming terrifying. Uh-oh. So you didn't bring Quirberus. And yet, it was in both our interests. You're not making my job any easier. That's for sure. I'm done with being a tool. I only obey myself. Oh yeah? And you decided what? What's your secret goal? How can you know what you want if you don't know who you are? If you are, in fact, nobody. You've never lived anything. You didn't ask to be here. Me, I crossed two centuries of nightmares to reach Akanash. I lost everything. Forever. Now, since you're so worn out, why don't you let go? You're just a bunch of old memories that are overflowing, screaming to get out of your skull. You're good for nothing. Listen, you and me, we have one life between two. You got the past, leave the future to me. It's a fair deal. Why are you so desperate to kill me, my guy? Me, who brought you into existence. What are you doing to I want to kill you because, well, at least I know it was my idea. Oh, really? Well, I can't argue with that. And yet, I could almost have whispered it to you. I'm so tired after all these years. All these voices gnawing at my mind. I came here to finish it. So, asking you to kill me is almost a good idea. Assuming, of course, that you're able to, which isn't the case. Ooh. Oh, you think so? Challenge. Wait and see. <laughs> I tried it. to kill myself long ago. I tried several times. I was finished. But all this damn hammer running in my veins won't let me die. Oh, really? It won't? Is over. I don't need an infective tool. Again, I just get stabbed every single time. Ah, my head. I can't stand it. Shut up. Everyone, shut up. Ah, I feel it. An elf. 
He's approaching. Quick, get out of here before my head explodes. Again, I just... This... This reflection... It's me? What have I become? A... A Rakash? A monster? What have I done? I feel so weak. How long ago did I leave my family? I am no longer worthy of being an orc. Wait, what? May my ancestors forgive me. What? What? Yeah. Where am I? Emmet, you're alive. I was afraid that I would arrive too late. Okay. Okay. Just earn an achievement. Oh, mission five. Done and Dunsey. You saved my life, elf. Why? I may have a few screws loose, but I think if any of you assholes were friends of mine, tall. I'd remember it. We have a common enemy. I. I'm an ambassador, the elf representative to the humans. I know that Styx aims to steal the heart of the tree. And the tree cannot live without its heart. Its death will lead to the destruction of Akanash. Styx is constantly seeking to poison relations between elves and humans in order to have a free hand. All it needs is a spark, and then it will be war. Ooh. And you were counting on me to stop him? I know that Styx and I look alike, but I'm the one who just got my ass kicked like a rookie, you know? He's stronger than me. I can't beat him. You will stop him. These are things that we elves can foresee in the Amber. But for that, you must rid yourself of his mark. The one that allows him to maintain his hold over you. Oh. And I know a way. Ooh. What? Where do I sign? Does it hurt? Tell me, damn it! Without this link between us, I could face him on equal terms. At the moment, you are but an imperfect duplicate. But if you were to place yourself inside one of our empty cocoons, you could become complete and be reborn as a perfect creature of the Amber. Ooh! Anything to break my link to sticks. So make it quick. Time is short. Take me to an empty cocoon. I will do it. But there are more pressing matters. The destruction by Aeron of the bridge that leads to the heart puts us in a situation close to war, but it has allowed us to delay Styx's plans. Now that we have Querberus, we must get him out of here. Without him, Styx will never find out how to reach the heart. All that remains is for you to escape his hold, and then to track him down and kill him, and I shall help you. I like this idea. But the most urgent task is to restore diplomatic relations between humans and elves. I have requested an audience with the governor. I shall expose the scheming of his son, Aeron. As a man of reason, Barryman will understand and tensions can be eased. I just need you to collect some documents from the library. I shall tell you more on the way. Very well. I'll help you to get these documents, and then we put Quirberus in the first airship leaving the atrium, and I get rid of this cursed mark. Ooh. And finally, a sticks hunt. 
I think I'm gonna enjoy this. Thank you. But before I leave, I must tell you that the other elves do not look kindly on our cooperation. Do not expect to be treated as a friend by my kin. Okay. The feeling's mutual. Do I kill him? Alright, now that I can, I'm gonna upgrade my skills. Well, listen to me. I shall tell you what to look for. Oh god, not this. Ah, damn it, I'll never get used to it. How do you do it? Not go batshit with people talking inside your head. Okay, so How do humans not go crazy by being alone inside their heads? Loneliness is good for no one. I mean, good point, but... Yeah, well, I'd pay a lot just to be left alone. Ah, get it. Tell me what you know. We must prove that Aeron is diverting Amber away and selling it to Akanash soldiers. This sacrilege violates the agreements between my people and Governor Barryman. And we must prove that Aeron is using prisoners as experimental subjects for I don't know what fantasy of his to control his kind. Alright, you're sure that his father won't get a medal for that? No, Barryman is not like that. He is a politician, a diplomat. He adores a challenge. He wants to control people by his power of conviction when he addresses the crowd. Not because he has drugged them beforehand. Aaron is just looking for a shortcut to power. So, the evidence I'm looking for is from the library? Understood. You should be able to find the accounts of the distillery and the warehouses signed by Errol. By cross-checking the data, it will be easy to show that a large amount of amber is lost along the way. In the same way, you can obtain prison registers, which will reveal the unbelievable increase in the number of deaths among prisoners since Aaron has been in charge. I have not been paying attention. What? Okay, I got it. No hanging about. Bring them to me. I take it upon myself to convince Barryman. Stop. Ugh. No, no. 
Yes. Oh, and an auto save. Oh, that's. Whoa. Mm. Strange. No. Yes. Oh, yeah, main objective. Baronin will be here soon. Come back quickly. I have the documents. I'm almost there. Well, I'm going to leave the episode off there. I hope you enjoyed it. Goodbye.